Hello everyone, you are watching the channel Incredible Facts. Off-road vehicles are a popular means of transportation not only among civilians, but also among the military. They can be lightly or heavily armored depending on the range of tasks performed. But their main goal is to quickly move to the place of confrontation with the ability to fire from a vehicle. Today, we will show you the 10 best military off-road vehicles in the world. RG Outrider the RG Outrider is a wheeled armored utility vehicle designed and manufactured by BAE Systems. The RG Outrider is able to fulfill most roles demanding high levels of payload or capacity together with demanding crew survivability. The RG Outrider BAE Systems provides a protection against IED, a mine protection under wheels Stanag Level 2A and Stanag Level 2B under center. The hull of the RG Outrider provides also a protection against small arms firing, 7.62x39mm armor piercing. The RG Outrider BAE systems can be fitted with a one-man turret, armed with a 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine gun. The RG Outrider BAE systems is powered by a Steyr turbocharged intercooled engine. The RG, the vehicle, can accommodate four people, including the driver. Dagor Dagor is a purpose-built, ultralight combat vehicle designed and built by Polaris Defense, a division of Polaris Industries, to meet the light mobility needs of light infantry and special operations forces. The new combat vehicle can transport a maximum payload of more than 14,000 kilograms, or up to nine infantrymen in support of expeditionary missions. The Dagor Ultralight Combat Vehicle can be configured to carry up to 48 weapons in weapons ring. It can also be fitted with multiple pintle mounts to hold machine guns. The Dagor Combat Vehicle is powered by a lightweight, commercial off-the-shelf turbo diesel engine located at the front section. The driveline system generates abundant power to provide superior off-road mobility in all-terrain conditions. Tardec ULV The ultralight vehicle research prototype represents a basic technology development and integration effort exploring new, out-of-the-box technologies and yielding a survivability-focused demonstration vehicle. The project's intent is to support the research and development of lighter weight armor solutions and novel blast mitigating technologies that may help shape, inform, or support future modernization and development efforts. The ULV prototype platform features a hybrid powertrain design with two electric motors, front and rear, with either capable of powering the vehicle, providing a level of mobility redundancy. The entire program resides at Tardec at the Detroit Arsenal in Warren, Michigan. Tardec directly reports to the U.S. Army Material Command's Research, Development, and Engineering Command. Dozer B The Dozer B is a 4x4 light armor vehicle designed and manufactured in Ukraine by the company Kharkiv Morozov Machine Building Design Bureau. The vehicle can carry three crew members and eight military personnel. The Dozer B series can be configured in various variants, including an armored personnel carrier, armored car, NBC reconnaissance vehicle, command vehicle, medical evacuation vehicle, scout vehicle, or utility automobile. The steel armor of the Dozer B provides protection against firing of small arms 7.62mm B-32 armor-piercing bullets. The vehicle floor is made on a special steel offering protection of mine explosion equal to 0.5 kilograms of TNT. The Dozer B is fitted with a remotely weapon station mounted at the front top of the hull, which can be armed with NSVT or KT 12.7mm heavy machine gun. Hunter TR-12 
The Hunter TR-12 is a multi-purpose infantry mobility vehicle designed to carry troops to dangerous areas. The vehicle designed and manufactured by Armor International for the Colombian Army. It can accommodate 12 people, including the driver. The Hunter TR-12 offers superior protection against guns and rifles, making it ideal for high-risk areas prone to clashes and ambushes. The armor of the Hunter TR-12 provides protection level B6. As all modern combat vehicles, the Hunter TR-12 can be equipped with single-ring mount armed with 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine gun. The Hunter TR-12 uses a 4x4 off-road chassis. With 4x4 wheel drive action, it is possible for the vehicle to reach remote, difficult to access places. Kia LTV The Kia Light Tactical Vehicle LTV, is a light military tactical utility vehicle released by South Korea's Kia Motors. It entered full production in 2016, as has been in service with the Republic of Korea Army in the same year. The basic four-door variant can carry one driver and three passengers, while a single-cab variant is also available. Modular components can be used on both single and double-cab variants. Both standard and armored variants are available, with the armored variant having extra protection, including bulletproof windshields and door glass, composite panels and doors, mine-protected flooring, blast-absorbing seats, and gunner protective armor. Weapons can be mounted on the roof opening, including manually operated canopy weapon mounts or remote-controlled weapon systems. Weapon mounts could be for 7.62mm or 12.7mm machine guns. 40mm automatic grenade launchers or anti-tank missiles. Polaris MRZR-4 The MRZR-4 is a highly mobile, multi-configurable, off-road vehicle from MRZR, range of vehicles developed by Polaris Industries. The vehicle can be rapidly deployed in missions even in the most difficult terrains. The MRZR vehicles are currently in service with the US and Allied forces in more than 20 countries. The vehicle offers seating for four troops and can accommodate up to six infantrymen when fitted with two optional rearward-facing seats on the cargo bed. The vehicle has a dry weight of 852.8 kilograms and can carry a maximum payload of 680.4 kilograms. The power plant integrates a Polaris ProStar four-stroke dual overhead camshaft twin-cylinder engine rated at 875 cc. The engine enables the vehicle to attain a top speed of 96 kilometers an hour. Enoch the Enoch Light Armored Patrol Vehicle is an armored military vehicle of the Bundeswehr, mostly in use with the German Army. It is a significantly further developed Wolf SSA based on the Mercedes-Benz G-Class. It features protection according to NATO Stanag 4569 Level 2 against rifle fire, landmines, and improvised explosive devices. The Enoch was especially designed to be deployed in harsh terrains and bad weather situations. The vehicle is available in two variants, with five doors and fully armored crew and cargo compartments, or with four doors and an armored crew compartment and unprotected rear body structure. The most spacious modification can accommodate five people, not including the driver. The vehicle can be armed with a 7.62mm machine gun or a 40mm automatic grenade launcher, or a 40mm automatic grenade launcher. AM General BRVO The BRVO blast resistant vehicle off road is a multi role vehicle designed and manufactured by the American company AM General for the GLTV, Joint Light Tactical Vehicle Program, for the United States Army to replace the fleet of light tactical vehicle Humvee. The general layout of the BRVO AM General vehicle is standard with the engine at the front, 
a crew compartment in the center, and a cargo area at the rear. BRVO features a crew capsule and modular armor already proven effective in government supervised blast testing. The first trial variant of the BRVO AM General is equipped with armored glass open top turret, which can be armed with a 7.62 or 12.7mm machine or automatic grenade launcher. The BRVO is motorized with a lightweight optimizer 3200 diesel engine, coupled to a 6 speed transmission. AMZ Tur 6 The Polish vehicles manufacturer AMZ, based in Kutno, introduced a new light armor patrol vehicle dubbed Tur 6 at 2018 year MSPO Defense and Security Exhibition, being held in Kielce. The Tur 6 was especially designed to perform different types of security missions and specific tasks like peacekeeping operations or convoy escort, EOD, ambulance, urban, or border patrolling. The vehicle offers protection against IEDs and all small arms, hand grenades, and fragmentation with its firing of small arms 762 by 51 mm caliber level 1 protection armor. The TUR-6 is capable of carrying both remote and manual weapon systems. The TUR-6 internal layout is designed to accommodate a 10-member crew, including driver and commander. That's all friends, thanks for watching, write in the comments which of the vehicles you liked the most. Also click the like button and subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any new interesting videos.